Welcome back, friends. Today we're talking about the uh, diligence of a Jehovah's Witness or the stupidity of a Jehovah's Witness. It's one or the other. Anyways, I was a Jehovah's Witness for 30 years, and during uh, my term as a Jehovah's Witness, I was out in the door to door ministry a lot, like a lot. And there was a lot of times I would go to the door and I'd knock on the door and someone would say, uh, just a minute. And then you'd wait there and you wouldn't knock again. You'd kind of be waiting and waiting and, and, and you'd look at your watch and you'd wonder how long has it been that I'm waiting. So then you you knock again and, and she says, just a minute. And uh, so you can imagine, and I've had calls where people are on the phone. And they come to the door, they open it briefly, and they say, uh, just a minute, I'm on the phone. And so they're on the phone, and then they shut the door, and then they disappear inside. And I'm standing there at the door, and what do I do? They said, just a minute, I'm on the phone. So they go inside, and then I'm standing there like for minutes, like for lots of minutes. And then uh, finally, uh, I knock on the door again. They open the door. Yeah, I'm still on the phone, just a minute. And then I got to wonder, is this just a game? <laughs> Is it just a game? Well, (laughs) I thought I was bad. You know, I might have stood at the door five, ten minutes maybe. But here's a story where Jehovah's Witnesses have waited at the door for 30 minutes. And not just one person. Three people waited at the door. So here it is. Um, Jehovah's Witnesses waited 30 minutes outside the house after receiving a response by a Mexican parrot was the one who answered, On my way! (laughs) So if you live in Mexico, you may have encountered Jehovah's Witnesses outside your home on more than one occasion. We speak of those who touch houses, read, or discuss scriptures of their religion. For this reason, the video of a parrot on TikTok went viral almost immediately. What is the relationship? It turns out that the Jehovah's Witnesses stayed half outside a home when they believed that someone was telling them that he would be out soon. But in reality, the person who answered them was a parakeet. The owner of the bird narrated what happened. According to what he said, arriving at his house, he found several Jehovah's Witnesses who told him they had been outside his home for 30 minutes. They did not leave the place because inside the home, someone shouted to them, Here I come! And the Witnesses thought that it was a person. But in reality, it was the parrot of the house. So uh, here it is. Let's uh, let's look at the story here. Voy llegando a la casa y hay unas personas. Yo veo que hay unas personas que eran unos testigos de Jehová. Voy llegando y les pregunto por qué se les ofrece. Y me dicen estamos esperando que nos abran porque hay una persona que está diciendo que le tocamos y nos dice, ahí voy, ahí voy, y pues no hay nadie, estoy yo solo. Resulta, no sé si escucharon, que hay un periquito que tenemos, que toca la puerta, y dice, ahí voy, ahí voy, y pues este loco, ahí tiene 30 minutos a los testigos de Jehová esperando, porque es el que les está diciendo, ahí voy, ahí voy. So uh, there you have it. Uh, the parrot answered answered the door. So that was uh, that was an example of that. So the article uh, goes on. The man even uh, knocked on his door to show that his parakeet actually responded as expected. The video went viral almost immediately. So witnesses were chattering. The witnesses after you told them there was no one in the house, or the witnesses finally someone answers us. Let's wait. And the the Jehovah's Witnesses right now don't go out to preach. It wasn't them, reads among other reactions. So there's been a lot of reactions to this. And, uh, but I I know from my own experience, you know, people would tell me to wait at the door. And and we get so many doors that uh, people are not interested that when you get a door when someone's interested and everyone, you knock and uh, I'll be right there. Well, you're gonna wait as a Jehovah's Witness because that might be your one golden call that whole month. Well, that's the rest of the story, folks. And until next time, 
keep living your life with love. Bye for now.